Welcome to a video on using GoToAssist's See It. In this video, I will refer to customers and experts. To clarify, a customer would be on-site communicating with and sending live video to an expert off-site. The expert will log in from seeit.gotoassist.com and will be ready to assist a customer. When a request comes through, the expert will click here to start a session with a customer. There are three ways to get into session with a customer. First, the expert could verbally give the customer the session key, which they would enter into their SEEIT mobile app. This is the most common option. Experts are also able to send the session link and support key to the customer via text message or email. SEEIT allows you to choose from five different languages when sending an email invitation. If the customer has not installed the SEEIT app yet, the link in the text message and or email will direct them to the App Store or Google Play Store to install the app, which is free. The customer will enter the nine-digit code on their Android or iOS device and will get into a session with the expert. In this video, I'm using an iPhone, however the process is similar on an Android device. Once in session, the customer's phone will show the rear-facing camera feed. In order to share this feed with the expert, the customer simply needs to click here, thus allowing the expert to view the camera and issue at hand, as if they were there. The customer will be actually streaming their live camera feed for the expert to view and help troubleshoot. The expert has a variety of features to help resolve and document the issue. We'll take a look at a few of these. First, see it includes built-in voice over IP, or VoIP, which allows the expert to speak with the customer from within the app and browser. Also, experts can click here to record their entire session. At the end of the recorded session, experts will receive a link that will let them download the recording for audit purposes or education. Down here, the expert can take a high-resolution snapshot of the video feed. This image can then be shared with the customer on their remote device. Notice on the split screen below that the customer sees the screenshot the expert is now showing. The expert can then use annotation tools to point out items to the customer. Experts are also able to add notes to any high-resolution snapshots taken. These snapshots are saved and are available after each session. Experts can then go back to the live video feed from the customer's phone and continue troubleshooting as needed. Experts can also use their annotation tools directly on a live feed. Finally, experts will also be able to add session notes here. On the customer's device, in the app, they have their own set of features. As mentioned, the customer can share, stop sharing, and pause their camera from the camera icon. They can mute and unmute their VoIP microphone by clicking on the microphone icon here. And customers can click here to turn on their device flashlight. This is very handy in low light troubleshooting scenarios. This icon here appears on the customer's device, but also in the software that the remote expert is using. This ends the SEEIT remote support session. 